Hey guys, it's Allie. So today is going to be the part two of cutting my emo hair. So basically, um, all you're gonna need is a comb and a pair of scissors and the technique. The last time we cut this hair, um, we cut it up to the shoulders and I think we're gonna cut it a little bit shorter or I'm gonna leave the length, I don't know. But I'm definitely gonna be cutting it so we're gonna make it like hopefully a lot shorter. So when you cut your wig hair, um, make sure that you part it like really, really to the side. Oh God, off to a good start. So basically I'm taking like vertical section and I'm just gonna cut downwards like that. We're gonna have to take drastic measures because it's, I don't think this is gonna work. Obviously this would work a lot better if it was on someone else's head and not mine because cutting your own hair is like disaster waiting to happen. I think the worst part is that like these wigs are like super thick in like all the wrong areas. Bye. So the layers are getting shorter now, which is a good idea. The shorter the layers, the more emo you get, so. there's more hair on this side of the wig than there is on the other side so I'm struggling a little I'm definitely gonna need to use the vacuum after this okay this is getting better you see all this volume that's what layers are for I do not recommend you guys do this with your actual hair. I feel like you guys would probably just attack me, be like, Allie, your freaking hair tutorial made me lose my hair and it looks all choppy. And it's like, yeah, that's because it is gonna be choppy if you do it like this. <laughs> So the bangs are gonna be a bit of an issue. Leaving your bangs long is not a problem, but sometimes they can get really thick and bothersome. So sometimes it's better if you layer your bangs. I want you guys to keep in mind that this is a wig. This is not like actual hair. So like, don't, uh, don't take this too seriously. In the front, what you're gonna wanna do is like cut it like vertically like you want to get that that like that kind of look like you literally can't see my eyes right now so remember the rule applies you take vertical sections and then you cut like downwards I don't see anything You gotta make sure you get rid of all the choppiness so it looks like everything is just really thinned out. Okay, so this is it. So this is what the final product looks like. But basically it's just a lot of layers and the side bangs and yeah, you're pretty much good. If you guys want, you could also put it in hair extensions like so it looks a little longer. All right, so yeah, you can always put hair extensions in and make it look more like long hair, funky kind of scene look. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I actually do think I miss like my dark hair, but I don't know, like I really like my silver hair, so I don't think I'd trade, but this is still a really good look. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay loyal, stay royal.